Hi, my name is Devin. I'm in ninth grade. And like you, I had to take the diagnostic. The results of the diagnostic decide what lessons you get. The diagnostic shows what you know and what you need to work on. I remember the last diagnostic I took. It was hard. The diagnostic will feel challenging. You may see questions you may not know how to answer because you haven't learned them. There were some questions I knew and some questions I didn't know, but I didn't give up. I tried my best and moved on. When I finished, I got lessons that were right for me. The diagnostic is not a typical test. Not all students will see the same questions. Every student should expect to get around half the questions correct. That's okay. Some of my friends rushed and got lessons that weren't right for them. They asked me what I did. Here are five things I shared with them. One, I didn't give up. Two, some of the questions may seem tricky, but I made sure to read the whole question. Three, some of the questions I didn't know the answer to. After thinking hard and working the problem out on a piece of paper, I took my best guess. Four, before I hit the done button, I checked my answer and made sure it was right. I changed a few of my answers that way. Five, I took my time. Once, I finished really fast, but then got put in lessons that weren't right for me. Warning, some students rush through and guess without reading the choices. If you do, or rush, don't. If you try your best, you'll get the right lessons for you. To answer a question, tap your answer, then tap the Done button. There is a My Progress button at the bottom of your screen. Tap it to see your progress. If you exit the test and come back later, the progress bar will show where you left off. What does the word bathtub mean? The bathtub is full of water. Which word means the opposite of long? A long bridge went across the pond. Which word means the opposite of sweet? Many kinds of fruit have a sweet taste. Which is the correct meaning of the word sea? A storm tossed the boat about in the sea. What is the correct meaning of the word male? This year, our classroom teacher is a male.
Which is the correct meaning of the word careful? Be careful when you handle glass objects so they don't break. Nice! You finished this part. There's still more to go. But first, let's give your brain a rest. <sighs> Way to go! You just finished the first part of your eye ready diagnostic. Sometimes, when it's been working hard like it just did, your brain can get tired and slow or nervous and jittery. I know some great ways to relax and wake up our brains and get them ready for the next part. Click start when you're ready. Imagine a balloon that is your favorite color. The one I pick is blue. Now imagine your balloon underneath your belly button that gets biggest as you breathe in and gets smaller as you breathe out. Here. Let's do it together. Place a hand on your belly and feel it getting bigger as you breathe in and get smaller as you breathe out. Breathe in through your nose and feel your belly filling up. Breathe out through your mouth and feel your belly go back in. Very nice. Look how nice and calm our brains are getting. Now our brains are awake and ready for the next part of the test. And remember, anytime your brain needs a break, you can take a few balloon breaths. To move through the pages of a passage, tap the arrows at the bottom of the page, or tap a page number to go to that page. Sometimes there is more than one thing for you to read or watch. You will know because you will see tabs like these that allow you to switch back and forth. To play a video or listen to an audio clip, tap this triangle. Tap this sign to pause. Tap this icon to change the volume. You can also drag the status bar back and forth to rewind or fast forward. Read the passage. Then click on the arrow to read the second passage on page 2. Click the arrow again to return to the first passage.
read the passage. Then click on the arrow to read the second passage on page 2. Click the arrow again to return to the first passage. Read the passage. Then click on the arrow to read the second passage on page 2. Click the arrow again to return to the first passage. Read the passage. Then click on the arrow to read the second passage on page 2. Click the arrow again to return to the first passage. Nice! You finished this part. There's still more to go. But first, let's give your brain a rest. <sighs> Welcome back to another brain break. Now that you have completed another part of the diagnostic, it's time to wake up our brains again. Click start when you're ready. We can imagine balloons again to help us with our belly breathing. Now imagine your balloon underneath your belly button that gets biggest as you breathe in and gets smaller as you breathe out. Here, let's do it together and this time let's count our breaths. Place a hand on your belly and feel it get bigger as you breathe in and get smaller as you breathe out. That's one. Breathe in through your nose and feel your belly filling up. Breathe out through your mouth and feel your belly go back in. Very nice. Look at your brain waking up. Three. Four. Five, six, seven. Brain and body are relaxed and ready for what's next. Don't forget. You can take balloon breaths anytime you feel like it will help. Read the passage. Then click on the arrow to read the second passage on page 2. Click the arrow again to return to the first passage. Read the passage. Then click on the arrow to read the second passage on page 2. Click the arrow again to return to the first passage. Read the passage. Then click on the arrow to read the second passage on page 2. Click the arrow again to return to the first passage.
cactus. The cactus is a desert plant. Deserts are very dry. Cactus. Find the word washed. Find the word knock. Read the word. Find the word you read. Sign. Read the word. Listen to find the word you read. Detracted. Determined. Read the word. Listen to find the word you read. Aluminum. Alleviate. Intimidate. Illuminate. Read the word. Listen to find the word you read. Deserted. Disaster. Disorder. Move the letters to correctly show the sounds in the word nest. Read the word. Find the word you read. Horn, hire, hear, hair. Move the letters to correctly show the sounds in the word grab. Move the letters to correctly show the sounds in the word bike. Read the word. Find the two words that the contraction stands for. Read the word. Listen to find the sound for the first syllable. Read. 